Hey guys, well, I didn't think this day would come, but it did. It's here, and so is my brand new Lego modular building. Yeah, pretty happy. Any guesses as to what one I got? Well, you're about to find out. Okay, so I'm gonna lift the camera up in three, two, one. Ta-da! There it is, assembly square. I finally got my own one, and I have to say that I got it for 179.99. Now, as we all know, the price of this did increase this year to £229.99, an increase of £50, which I covered in one of my videos recently. So I am very happy to be the proud owner of one of these. Um, I know I don't sound very excited, but I can't wait to build it. I'm already working out space on where to put it because this is, it's just so nice. Like, out of all the modulars, I'm glad this is my first one, it, you know, obviously it's the 10 year anniversary modular as well. This year currently celebrating 15 years, but yeah, I mean, it is a big box. It's bigger than I thought it would be and it's quite heavy too, but then, you know, there's a lot of parts in there. Yeah. Ah, oh, that detector's office, that would be nice if I could get one of those. But you know, maybe one day on the second hand eBay market, <laughs> but yeah. Now, I didn't buy this for investment, and some of you might be thinking, why not? Especially since I got it before that kind of price increase. I got it on a, from a company called Smith's here in the UK. And it was, this was the very, well, at the time of purchasing, this was the last one in my entire city. Because there's only one, well, there's only one Smith's in my city, but it was the last one they had in stock. And I think this one was probably a display, like, on, on the shelves at the at the top or something because as you can see just down the corner there is a bit of damage the box isn't mint it's a bit bent up down there but that's okay i'll keep it anyway because if i do decide to sell it later down the line then having the box is always a bonus even if it's not in the best condition it helps but yeah i can't wait to build this yeah that's gonna be nice see now i've got one i just want to get more i want to get the police station I want to get the boutique hotel. I do want to get the detective's office. And of course, Daily Bugle, which isn't officially a modular building, but it connects with them. And that would look nice with these as well, although it's much taller. So guys, I know it was only a quick video, but I just wanted to kind of mark this bit of history. This is a big part of my Lego history. It's the first modular building I've ever bought, brand new. Oh man, I mean, I didn't, plan to get it now but I, I kind of had to given the whole price change things before it got too expensive so luckily I didn't because I don't think it's worth 50 pounds more especially if it's not retired yet which it isn't or well, it might be our stock at Lego and some other places but I managed to get this one yeah so um I will be building it I will probably be making more videos on it such as placing it and review and things like that give my thoughts on it but yeah that's uh i'm looking at it right now it's just down there yeah it's gonna be a good one but anyway thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe for more and check out some of our other videos and well happy building